Welcome to another MLogic video tutorial. In this video tutorial, we will go through how to use the IBM ITDT diagnostic tool to run the full write test diagnostic on your MLogic M-Tape or M-Rack unit. The full write test will do a read and write diagnostic to the entire cartridge as well as track performance along the way. To obtain the IBM ITDT diagnostic tool, you can contact support at mlogic.com for this needed file. Make sure your M-Tape or M-Rack unit is attached and powered on before starting the diagnostic tool. You want to have a spare LTO tape that does not have important data on it. This test will format the tape several times and wipe clean whatever is on the tape. Once you've installed the ITDT diagnostic tool and started up, this is the first screen you will be presented with. If asked to update, just click on Cancel. Click on the Scan option to have the diagnostic tool find the attached device. You should see the device show up under Devices with it already checked. The serial number of the LTO device is shown as well as the current firmware. Next, we want to click on the Test pull-down menu right below the Scan option and select Full Write. The diagnostic Full Write will now begin. You will be asked what transfer size to use. Select 1024. You will then be asked what type of data to write. Select Incompressible. The test will then start. This test can take up to six to seven hours to complete, so I will speed this up for this tutorial. Once the diagnostic has completed, you will see a green check mark in the status information window, letting you know the test has completed successfully. If the test did not pass, you will see an error message in the status information window along with an error code. If that is the case, you can pass this information onto an MLogic support representative. Shown here is the test data that was run during the test. The diagnostic data here shows the data type selected to run, the transfer size selected, data size in megabytes, the amount of time in seconds, and the average data rate during the diagnostic test. In this window, you can see the log files that were created during the test. These are the files that can be sent to MLogic Tech Support if you have an issue during the test. This video is just a demonstration on how to use the ITDT diagnostic tool to run the full write diagnostic test on your unit. The firmware revisions used in this demonstration might not reflect the most current revisions. Thanks for watching. Be sure to click on the subscribe button below to get more information on MLogic video tutorials.